everyone, Waterbot here, and welcome to Expansion Core. It is a open world survival crafting base defense kind of game. Uh, input world name. I want a big apple. Perfect. I want a big apple to create new worlds. Let's do it. I, I really kind of backed myself into a corner with that initial writing. Okay, learning to walk. Looks like you've walked. Uh, hi. Well, uh, hi. Hi, I'm here. Where is here? I do not know. Blunt weapon. Looks like a path is blocked. You'll need something more than bare hands. Pick up objects with E. Alright. I'm getting some, like, mad muck vibes from this right off the bat, and that's not bad. You're an SR unit. She should have a built-in crafting matrix. Oh, inventory is full. What? Okay, flint sword, stone pick, and... Oh, not enough ingredients. Okay, we can also make, like, wooden helmets and some other things, but I guess we gotta get the pickaxe first. Uh, how do I equip this? Okay, great. Break through that boulder, come find me. Quick equip your axe with Q. Wow. Okay. You know, this works. There's the... There's our flint. Uh, tab for this. Grab the stone pickaxe while we're here. Can I make a flint sword? Yes, but I need more branches. Hold up, let me see if I can get a bit more. Muck but less jank? Hey, you know, that sounds pretty good to me. I'm gonna make this? No, I need another flint, and I'm not gonna get that in here. So I guess let's just keep rolling. Okay, status protected by ally within range. Install core into small mobile base. I see. So pick up the core. Pleasure to meet you. Slap me in the mobile base unit. Should be able to move. Damn, doesn't look like it can move on my own. Looks like you're the boss. Saw a door there. Hold F to bring up the command menu. F to select all follow. Boop. Cool. So I have a mobile base, whatever this is. Oh, and I have to get it to stand on button. Okay. Single hold. Hopefully he'll just stay there. That's interesting. Okay, I'll follow. What? I am out here. Cool. Local creatures seem to have mutated. Collect some samples for analysis. Stick close. Something's trying to hack us. Mobile base protects you from losing integrity. Your integrity drops to zero. Your systems will stop sh or start shutting down. What? Well, that's interesting. Well, I can get branches. Okay, so I think we're heading over for that highlight, maybe? I don't know. Or, no, actually, it looks like we're... We're on a fight bender. There we go. What else do we get? Spitter, bile, shoot. Okay, get this. There's also an energy fragment. Looks like we're... Our base is getting messed up a little bit. Where are you going? Okay, the creatures are pretty messed up. I think we can repurpose these energy fragments into something useful. Try building us another friend. Gather more resources and... Try placing your first blueprint. Press B. Oh. <laughs> Scrap ram bot, storage bot, small furnace bot, tiny axe bot. Um. Well, I think we're going to need this, but how the hell am I going to have enough inventory space? We also have structures, small crate. Standing torch, basic research station, furnace. Okay, so I'm going to try just placing a blueprint for this down. Okay. T to toss over. Cool, so we can snag this. Oh, aggression level neutral. Deploy the deploy the mobile base. Oh, and I can also give it uh I can give it a slot. Well that's interesting. Transfer bot, small mobile base. Open stockpile. Okay. Other branch. 
T to transfer. We still have the extra rocks. Now, can I... Can I knock over a tree? I can! What about the stumps? No, nope, doesn't look like it can do anything with the stumps. Well, that's okay. So the biggest issue I'm having with this right now is the ti absolutely tiny starting backpack is a little painful. Okay. Splitter bile and a standard upgrade. What do I do with the standard upgrade? Boost speed, 20%. Huh. I wonder if we put that into a, a creature. Okay, so we also have another one of these to potentially make. Oh cool. Putting the base uh putting the base down also uh gives it gives us a much bigger area to work with. I appreciate that. Okay, log stick. Do you have any other trees in the immediate area? We have a beetle shell. We have a couple of sticks. Because, yeah, I might want to give this guy specifically... Whoops. There we go. I might want to give this guy very specifically... Or, wait, what am I even saying? I don't know. My brain's elsewhere. See how much I lose integrity. Like a little bit. It's not too bad. I want to give this guy some storage space. And then move on. Oop. Okay. Do we just get integrity back? We do. Okay, so that's big. Okay. Built. Okay, so... When it's like this, we can store some basic resources. I'll move these over. Uh, jeez. What do we do next? Chassis. Scrap Rambot. Furnace bot or a tiny axe bot? Flint logs. A lot of flint logs and one energy fragment. I think we start with the, um... Let's see. I think, we, I think we'll start with a, a basic, like, fighty bot, probably. There's a lot of flint. Do we give this guy the furnace? Yeah, we should give him a furnace. I guess, let's see what's required for that one. Logs, flints, and rocks. Oof. Open stockpile. Okay, so this this is a little tougher. Nothing that allows us to craft better tools yet? No. I think we'll have to upgrade the, uh, the base. But that's fine. You know what's... Uh, quick save too. I want a gra <laughs> I want a big apple. Wow, these are some options. Motion blur off. Thank you. Field of view actually looks like it's perfectly fine. I'm gonna set max F FPS to sixty. Sometimes these game get games get kind of wonky. Okay. The other thing I want to check is: Does the music sound fine? Wait, did I just break that rock? Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Okay, stockpile. So we need we need a lot of rocks for this one. And also log. Okay. Snag those. What is this? Copper ore. Well, I guess we kinda want that furnace. Let's see. Don't have any logs. Do have more rock. I do not know what that noise is. It gets kind of eerie, frankly. We have a bunch of trees. Uh, here. I Okay, we can also scrap this thing if I want to. So I might be able to get the, the resources I'm looking for. Uh, this is rough. It is rough, but it's one of those where, like, I, I can... I can look past a lot of the roughness in favor of... Okay, so we just get one stick and log back. Sadly, I don't really need 
sticks for much. Okay, I do actually like this music. Hopefully it plays a little bit more consistently. But yeah, we also need to be quieter. Okay, so artist set up. Oh. That's an issue. So I, I'm actually gonna have to range out if I wanna get that, that mobile furnace going. Let's see, that's an energy fragment. So I can't do anything with that. All right, this is fine. Yeah, it definitely has a little ways to go, but it is also a demo, so it's kind of it's kind of easy for me to not care. Uh, let's see. I'm going to just drop a couple of these sticks and maybe that so I can build this faster. I think I'm just going to run out and break trees. and come back rather than picking this guy up. I was kind of hoping that half completed, um, the half completed base stuff would actually, uh, just come with me as opposed to get, uh, sucked up. I don't know. Or get dropped, you know, canceled the construction. It's fine. I don't know why I can't string sentences together at the moment. My brain is elsewhere, apparently. Make me want to play Grounded. I can see that. I'm really looking forward to when Grounded uh, comes out officially. Okay, now we just need a rock. Okay, snag this. Early access games like this tend to ignore making good UIs. Good UI is actually, like, hard. Uh, not that it matters too much, but my assumption is to some degree... Alright, so we've got the smelter. We are going to need some more fuel. Hopefully we can burn the sticks. Uh, but like UI is hard. I think for them, uh, for the devs, it's more important to just have a functional game. And yeah, it's September for granted. I know. I know. I'm looking forward to it. I don't know how, how I'm going to engage with it. Nope. Here's the question, does it keep smelting? Yeah. Looks like we need more fuel. Oh, input and output. Got it. Well, this seems to be a good good way of getting rid of all these spare sticks. They do not act as a decent fuel. Yeah, Cult of the Lamb's out in a few weeks. No, I think it's out on like the 4th. It's either out on the 4th, or at least the embargo drops on the 4th. It's out soon. Oh, it's the 11th for you guys. Okay, got it. Okay, access core. This is my equipment. Eh, it doesn't seem like there's too much to do with this. But I think I'm going to have to make these suckers before I can do too much else. So we have the energy fragments. I might want to consider going for the storage bots rather than a scrap ram. One way or another, I'm going to need to pop some trees here. Grab the spitter bile. Ugh. Inventory is still full. Okay, there. That clears us out pretty good. Axbot is good for remote gathering. Yeah, it looks like it. Now let's uh, let's move over to a denser area of trees. We also have these golden, um, eh, let's not go for that. That is, that is way too small, frankly. And we have these like golden beacons in the distance, which actually might be kind of neat. Go investigate. Wow, this was. Not much wood, but that's fine. Oh, the robots are derpy. Frankly, I like it. Especially if it's, like, made out of wood. Keep it derpy, make it weird. Uh, make me laugh. I'm very glad hitting this thing with a rock doesn't seem to damage it at all. Okay, uh, do we think we're good? I have no idea. 
Let's, uh, I could also make armor, but do you want to just start with a storage bot? Or a log bot? Because storage bot's going to require rock, some, eh, no, 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 no. Start working on this, boyo. We'll do storage. It'll make it easier to make the next ones. It's not like we're in a whole lot of danger anyway. So I need two more branches, two more logs, and two rocks. Should actually be pretty easy. Well, there's the branches. I just need more tree. Hello, bug. Another beetle shell. I have no idea if those are any good. The sunset's like, wow, turn on the dark. Hey, who turned off the lights? That episode messed me up like nobody's business. I don't do horror much, and that one was not cool. The game was not kidding when it said demo, uh, demo was not bug-free. Horror. Inventory is full. Shoot. We have many log. Ah, uh, whatever. Let's just run back. I have to figure out how to actually power mobile base. Okay, do we have any rocks in the area? One over there, one over here next to a bug. Let's do this. Hello, bug. I know there was a weird man up the hill. And big copper deposit. Okay. Okay, power of your base uh, regenerates when you deployed it. Cool. Okay, let's drop these for a second. Bring these with. Because if I can have the... Uh, if I can have a storage bot with me, we can carry some more things around. <laughs> Aggression level. Neutral. I don't want it to go attack things. Let's see. Use an energy fragment to repair. Gotcha. Oh, shoot. How do I... Uh, options. What was the... I'm so glad I can check this again. What is the control button again? Oh. Uh, command to follow... Cool. I think I can just look at them and press T. Now you look like a weird, weird dude that is in need of a smacking. I should probably get an actual weapon. Yes, did drop an energy fragment. That's what I was wondering. Damn, just gonna kill the dinosaur? Everybody do the dinosaur. Alright, Axe Bot, Scrap Ram Bot. Okay, so we need... One more branch, three logs, four rocks. Oh, wow, look at that thing over there. It's just a freaking energy twister. Okay. So there's our three logs. There's our branches. Now all we need is rock. Man. I know I'm showing my age. But I remember Colbert's, like, kind of parody presidential campaign thing that he did a long time ago with Herman Cain. Whenever I, uh, whenever I say, like, rock you or something kind of remotely similar to that, I always want to say, like, rock you like a Herman Cain, but that just kind of hits different after the last couple of years. That tornado is getting closer. Oh, 
Hello, S Scrap Rambot. Oh, sick. Look. There's goodies in the distance. Oh. Give me a second. I need him to follow me. Are we otherwise good? Yeah. I'm going to stay away from that evil, evil killer tornado. I know there's some stuff I've left on the ground, but I don't think I care. Right, run right into the tornado. Save game. I want to spin. Save to slot. Game is saved. Okay, good. Perfect. And we go. <laughs> I didn't think you'd actually do it. Hey, look, if I can save the game, I'm doing whatever the hell I want. Oh, it's chucking rocks. Oh, but they break. Hello, giant vortex of doom. Show me your ways. Wait, there's like a core in this. Huh. Well, frankly, I'm going to reload because that's expensive. I was really hoping it would throw me. Hey, Def, if you're watching, please make it so a tornado send me, sends me like seven billion miles away. Anyway, let's go check out one of these beacon things. I'm extremely disappointed that you did not get Yot. I know! I wanted to get Jotunheimed. Send me to Valhalla. I deserve it. I was... <laughs> I freaking love the robots in this. They're magical. Okay, now that you're up to speed, we need to start the real mission. Talk to a friend to follow us. Okay. Is this where it wants me to go? I have no idea. Open abandoned shipyard. Hub protection beam. Type protection. Difficulty very easy for us. Large station projects a large dome of protection. Ooh, spawn hub. Okay, so we got two enemy waves. Well, I've got a scrap ram bot. Oh, there it is. I probably should have made a sword. Okay, how are you doing? Ish. Okay. There's that. Interesting. I wonder if its butt is actually a weak point. Might be. Okay, where's the next one? There you are. Grab the mandible and get a smack in. Because if I'm the one tanking it, I think I heal over time or not. It's hard to tell. Almost feels like the robots have more detail and animation than the character. I love that. They're derpy. Uh oh. It is dog. Dogbert. Bad dog. Bad hurt dog. Okay, hurt dog dead. Whoa, that's a big beetle. That's a big bug. Okay, got it. Got a module. Oop. Yeah! Yeah! Okay, so we've spawned that thing, which is cool, except for the Twisters decided to come by and say hi and hurt us pretty bad. Okay, I'm going to set this up for a bit. I'm going to hope that Twister ain't coming for me. I think it is, actually. Uh, 
Damn. I'll have to come back for them. At least we vaguely know where they are. Uh, huh. I make a flint sword. Not even close. I'm actually quite curious if that that twister is designed to hunt me down. Because it lightly f feels like that. Ah, no flint. Oh, flint. Okay, because what we, what we want is a flint sword. So two flints, a rock, and two branches. Okay, so I, now all we need is branches. Because I think having a sword would help. Inventory is full, of course. Or is it branches or is it... Lo oh, no, 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 no. I need another flint rock. Yeah, I'm I'm ninety nine percent certain that that twister will stay there and haunt that area. Apparently, okay. Small health kit <sighs> requires energy fragments. Rude. And we also have these defunct upgrades. Help! Ooh, health regen. Okay, so I'm going to need to go chop some trees. I guess I'm just going to get tougher so the uh, tornado cannot kill me. Hopefully it moves away from there. be pretty sad if I can't get those bots back. I'm going to have that sit there and... Recover energy? Does it also heal? Yes, it does. Am I healing? Oh, I am also healing. I wonder if I can actually bring this back over. Okay, so I need branches and logs. Let's see, legs. Oh, we'll start with the, the legs. E to equip. But yeah, I can't grab the upgrades, so they've got to be something else. Okay, is the twister gone? Looks like the twister is gone. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try and take the mobile base back to where my um my dead dead row buddies are and see if I can get him to revive them with the uh repair AoE. It might not, I might have to go get some energy bits to fix them up, but if we can just pick them up by by just recharging next to it, I would be a happy camper. Okay, there they are. And there's the twister in the distance. Okay, looks like something else dropped with the hub. Seems like another core. Pick it up so we can put it to use. Okay. Uh, let's see. Is that the core? That looks like the core. I have enough integrity I can go grab this, no problem. Let's see if this will fix up fix up my row buddies. If it does not, that's unfortunate. Wonder might have found the game that takes over the stream. Nah. As much as that actually woo. Oh, access core. Project current core. Okay, hopefully we can find some upgrades. We're a bit weak at the moment. Machines with cores, including you and your mobile base, are capable of being upgraded. Upgrades in the current build are found in random drops. Cores can be accessed in the details panel by clicking the core icon. Try accessing your personal core. Oh. 
It does reduce my attack speed though. That's a bit tough. There was another one. Okay. So we have movement speed plus 20%. Uh, do I want to have... No, I'll take the... Actually, maybe not. I see, so we can have one for each. So I'm going to go back to this sucker. And I'm going to give it the move speed, so it can, it can stick with me. Looks like these guys are just actual down for the count. Until I can find an energy energy node. Oh, you know what? The reason why I'm not taking damage is because of this thing. And, uh, what is this? This is Commander Connolly. I'm the third generation commander of the Kronos. We see you've acti reactivated one of the hubs. We're prepared to open our trade lines to you. Beacon's main purpose is allow for trading. Requires a lot of energy to send the request signal. First, get the beacon to at least 10 energy units by fueling, fueling it with energy fragments. Ugh. Okay. And is this thing just my shield generator? It's freaking huge, man. But yeah, it doesn't look like it can do anything with this. So, now I get to get energy fragments, which are dropped by critters? There we go. I don't know about stuff like beetle cores. We mostly just want fragments and nothing more. I had better luck getting cores from the, the derpy dinosaurs. But they might be harder to find. I think that's one in the distance. Want to listen to Beetle Core? <laughs> what even would that be? I have no idea. Oh, this, this one's Angie. What? 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 Angie, and dropped its spine. Oh, I must be out of the safety zone. Oh, no! Okay. Where the heck is my base again? It's over here-ish? Okay, it's over here. I wish you could actually see the giant safety zone being projected by the, um... By the hub. Because you can see my, my repair bubble, but you can't see the hub one. There's stuff over there. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna keep kind of wandering around a little bit. Because I've got enough integrity that I can kind of safely do things. I mostly just need to find... Like, one bit of, uh, like, two energy fragments. I was really hoping the enemies would drop them a little bit more often. Frankly, I almost kind of wish energy fragments weren't a droppable resource. Ooh, ooh. Nope. It's got iron and copper ore, which, like, is kind of nice, but isn't what I'm looking for. Um. What was I going to say? Resource, oh, right, resource-wise. Uh, I wish the energy units weren't a thing that were occasionally dropped by enemies, but instead just like a small, like, currency value that you get from every enemy. Okay, no integrity. I swear these tornadoes are actually haunting me. My face. Not only is it haunting me, it is very clearly aiming for me too. Oh! 
Oh. The hell is this? It's me, but evil? Oh, there's multiple of them. Okay. Well, I think this conclusively proves that uh, the tornadoes actually just straight up hate my guts. I'm going to head back towards the safety of the hub. I just wanted to repair my robots, man. Here's the problem. Because I set that back to aggressive, it is like trying to follow me, but also trying to fight them. Okay, good. With the extra movement speed, uh, it has no trouble keeping pace with me at full speed. I think I'm gonna need some more, like, clobber bots. I... okay. My mobile base is dead. Oh. It has... It has a... A repair timer, so it'll be back. That is good. Do the bad dudes come with a tornado, or is that a coincidence? I don't know. Come on, mobile base. I see some red crystals around here. Okay, it's almost dawn. Do the bad dudes disappear with the dawn, or am I just actually bonered? Come on! They seem to... I think they're supposed to be tied to the tornado, but... But... I... I... I don't know, man. And I'm dead. Okay, cool. Well... I think I'm going to stop here. I whatever these things are supposed to be uh I'm I'm not built to deal with them at the moment. I think I'm supposed to like have robots to fight, but unfortunately losing my robots to the tornado in the distance uh, that part needs a bit of polish, but the rest of this is incredibly positive. I like the I like the mobile base. I like the fact that I'm building a robot army to help help fight out and a bunch of other things. Like the game is a bit derpy, but it's a demo. And it's a really good demo from what I've seen so far. Like, if this can get polished up, if a little bit of that kind of RKO difficulty curve can be um, fixed up a little bit. And, like, I do like the, uh, I do like these options, kind of. Obviously here, base. Okay. Actually, it looks like we might be safe. All the other darkened robots have just pieced out. So I only have this one. I'll see if I can kill one. They look like they're supposed to be evil, slightly leggier versions of me. There we go. And it looks like they are supposed to die in the sun. And, I mean, look at all those energy fragments now. So, oh... Perfect. Yeah, so I can actually repair these. It's charcoal to increase power. I mean, I could, but now I just have... I, I actually have some energy fragments I can work with, which is kind of nice. Set them all to follow, kind of. What I want you to do... Carry all of these... Oh, energy fragments, but we got a crystal shard. Good for large power sources. Interesting. 
Okay, well, one way or another, I think we're at a good stopping point for this. Obviously, there's more I could kind of do, but uh, game's a little, a little rougher on the edges, and I think I'd rather come back to this again for the, uh, yeah, maybe it's a way to end the demo. Yeah, possibly. Um, but I'll come back to this when it hits early access, and then maybe really come back to it when it hits 1.0. Because I like what it's doing so far. It just needs some work. And that's fine. Save again? Yeah, let's do it. I want to shave. Perfect. Do not question my saving. <laughs> Charming game, though. I like it. But let's move on to the next for now. Come back to this when it's further along.